Okay, so we are back and we are going to start just like we did before. So we type in PQ method. Our path is Q Workshop 2012. And if we wanted to verify, we could go into to Q Enter and go into Query Q. And we can see that I've entered seven sorts. It's not everybody, but it's enough to demonstrate. <clears throat> so I'm going to go back to our list. And I could do a centroid factor analysis. That would just be three. How many centroids do you wish to extract? If seven is okay, I can just hit enter. So and then it tells me something about number three as a communality of 1.038. Do you want to have factor loadings adjusted? I usually say no. <clears throat> and voila, I've done a centroid. I could do the same thing for PCA, right? So principal components, it looks a little different. It shows me the eigenvalues and um, some percentages. I can hit enter. <clears throat> and doesn't look very exciting. Right. So it says that it is output seven factors. So the default is seven. If we want to know um, what we might have, we could do the next step, which is to rotate. We could do a manual rotation or Verimax. Um, and that's where we can really see what's happened, whether we've done centroid or principal components. So we might do centroid again. We'll say seven, we'll say no. And now we can do the next step, which will be the next video, which is looking at Q centroid, right? Looking at it from uh, the Q rotate, which uses a special program that's part of this overall program.